Welcome to Miss Michelle's Storytime, presenting Back to School Storytime. First Grade, Here I Come by Nancy Carlson. The first day of school was over, and when Henry got off the bus, his mother and little brother Pete were waiting for him. How did you like first grade? asked his mom. I didn't like it because I missed kindergarten, said Henry. Tell me all about it, said his mom. Well, my teacher isn't at all like my kindergarten teacher, Miss Bradley, because... My first grade teacher is a mister. But Mr. McCarthy likes my pet worm. And he even has a cool science corner with plants, bugs, rocks, and a guinea pig named Curly. The science corner sounds neat, said Henry's mom. Where do you sit? At my own desk that has my name on it. Do you sit near any of your friends? No, I didn't know anyone in my class except Tony and Sydney from kindergarten. But guess what? I made a new friend named Oswaldo and he sits next to me. Oswaldo likes soccer and spiders just like I do. He sounds nice. Did you learn anything new today? Yes. We learned some math, some new songs with Ms. Cruz, and a science fact. Mr. McCarthy also took us to the library. And he says soon we'll learn how to read books. But today I already learned one word. When I have to go to the bathroom, I look for the door that says B-O-Y-S. I also learned that when you open Curly's cage door, he can run really fast. Wow, you learned a lot. How was lunch? The lunchroom was so big, and I was worried the food would be gross, but... Tuna melts are really good. Did you go out for recess? Yes, but the fifth graders hogged the monkey bars, so... Mr. McCarthy played kickball with us. What did you do after recess? Asked his mom. We went to art class. We had a snack break. And then I got sent to the principal's office, said Henry. Oh no, did you get in trouble? No, Mr. McCarthy asked me to deliver a note to the principal and I didn't even get lost. Good for you, said Henry's mom. First grade does sound different from kindergarten. Yeah, but it's not too much for me because I'm a real first grader now. Now that you've listened to the story and followed along, it's time to answer some questions. Why doesn't Henry like the first grade? What did Henry like about lunch? How is Henry's school day similar or different to your school day? What are you looking forward to doing in the first grade? Great job! We hope you had fun reading, listening, and thinking about the story. <laughs>